Assalamu alaikum rahmatullah. Let's think about how to determine BMI value and what about the BMI. It's about something like to, to determine easily about people's health. Uh, either a person is overweight, either a person is healthy or a person is obese and what is the stage of their obesity. So determining BMI, we only need two quantities of a person. That is the body mass of that person and the height of the person. So according to height, what should be the mass of the body that is determined by BMI value. So we can see that BMI is simply said that body mass index which is developed by Adolf Quetelet in 19th century. So there are some categories that which categories we can measure a person either underweight or the person is healthy or the person is the overweight or just first stage of obesity, second stage of obesity or extreme obese. So how do you measure? Think about a very simple formula that the body mass kilogram and the height is meter square. But the thing is, um, in some cases, suppose a person height is given as a feet or some other measure of unit, then we need to convert it into meter and then we need to find the value of BMI of that person. But the thing is we need to understand that the BMI value that is less than 18.5 if someone's BMI like 16 or 17 or 17.25 it means that the person is underweight and that person requires more food consuming more food and if somebody's BMI comes out like within the 19 to 25 24 that is best that is the ideal body or the ideal scale of health and then if it is less than 30, starting from 25 or 26 or 27, then we can say, okay, this person is overweight. So how to determine this BMI? You see, there are kilogram per meter square. Suppose uh, a person's body mass is 70 kilogram. If I say that person's body mass is 70 kilogram, but the height is given as, uh, uh, suppose she is, uh, or he is uh, 5 feet, 5 feet 6 inches if it's given like that then we know that m that means the kilogram is given but we need to convert this 5 feet 6 inches into meter square that's the problem so i know that if if you don't know that how to how to convert it into meter think about it we know that one one feet one feet is 12 inches we need to know it. And another thing that 2.45 or we can say that 2.4 centimeter, okay, centimeter is equal to 1 inch. So if somebody's height is given 5 feet 6 inches, how to convert it in meter? Think about the 5 feet that is 5 times 12 inches. 5 times 12 inches plus 6 inches so it's altogether 60 inches plus 6 inches so that is 66 inches so that means 5 feet 6 inches is equal 66 inches now we need to convert it into meter think about one thing 1 meter is equal 39.37 inches you can use this is actually into converting to meter so you know that 1 meter is equal 39.37 inches so as a person's height is given 66 inches then I can say that 66 divided by 39.37 is the height of meter of that person so if 66 inches is given so that I can use 66 divided by 39.37 and this is actually 1.67 1.67 meter. So right now I can say that is 1.67 meter. So the person's height was given as 5 feet 6 inches and the weight is given 70 kilogram. 
So we got it, the height of the person as a meter, right? You got BMI is actually 70 is the kilogram of that person divided by 1.67 whole square. So we got it, 70, so say 70 divided by 1.67 square, so it's 25.09. So we can say that is 25.09 So the unit should be kg per meter square So 25.09 is the BMI of this person where the height of this person is 5 feet 6 inches and 70 kg So we can say a slightly, slightly overweight The person is slightly overweight so I think you also can do uh, your own BMI calculations and you can actually do the calculations of your families, your parents, your sisters, your cousins so that they can have an idea that what, how their health is like, like underweight or standard scale or overweight or first stage or second stage. So if you find somebody's BMI is more than 40, it means that this person is extremely obese and and that, that person needs actually the health advisory from the medical doctors. So what can be done in this case if somebody is fine overweight on one and only one thing that is actually exercise. The physical exercise is a key factor for making persons fit. So if we need a fit body, if we need to, to conduct a healthy life, we must be more active and uh, physical exercise is one of the key factors here. And of course diet. We definitely need to focus on our diet. Without focusing diet properly, we cannot maintain our good health. So definitely, definitely diet and physical exercise is a factor. So this is the BMI value and I hope you can do it in case of uh, body height is given and the body weight is given. So this is the way that we can actually determine BMI. In the next video I am coming with another uh, video that is determining BMR which is basal metabolic rate. So see you soon. Take care. Stay well.